Hello dear guys and once again I welcome you to counsel friend your counsel your friend so this time again I am here to give you the cutoffs of different states and different categories in those states so we will be sharing the cutoffs of Telangana and Andhra Pradesh this time so are you ready are you starting your journey for MBBS so this video will be of really a great use to you because every year cutoffs change and we are really worried about our cutoff whether our marks are going to beget us any government or any private medical college so this time we are going to see this here i am going to give you the cutoffs of only mbbs course i am not going to give you the cutoff of bds and other paramedical courses and that too only for government medical colleges because in private medical colleges there are different uh, things applicable like management quota like some direct admission in some special minority quota and all so it is very difficult to find out how exactly my marks are going to beget me that particular college so that's why we are going to share with you the quotas of your category for government medical college so here we go so you must be aware that the quotas are divided into two broad categories first is the all india quota and the second is state quota all india quota is 15 percent whereas the state quota is 85 percent of the whole medical colleges and all medical seats lying in that particular state so what is that 15 percent all india quota that i have already shared in one of my videos you can watch that video with the link above there and you can watch through the uh, link which i have already provided in the description box so this time again I'm not going to repeat all that but only for Telangana and Andhra Pradesh state I'm going to share your cutoffs of the state wise and category wise of your state so what is the seat matrix this is the website you have to apply through that is ntruhs.ap.nic.in this is the website through which you have to apply for the counseling now we will be seeing the number of MBBS government medical colleges seats so it is 2495 seats in government medical college and for private medical colleges we have 3040 seats in all there are 5535 seats in government as well as private medical colleges for MBBS in Andhra Pradesh region for BDS bachelor of dental surgery we have 140 seats for government dental colleges and 1050 seats for private dental colleges and it gives us a total of 1190 seats for uh, government medical colleges the number is 13 there are 13 government medical colleges in Andhra and there are total 18 private medical colleges in Andhra and total number of dental colleges in Andhra are 2 and total number of private dental colleges in Andhra are 11 so this is the seat matrix now we will be seeing the list of documents that you need to procure that you need to start your claim to to start your initiate your counseling process so this is the list of documents make sure that you have all these documents ready before you enter into the counseling process so it is candidate ssc class 10th or birth certificate for the age proof candidates hsc certificate that's mark sheet passing certificate of the candidate from class 6 to class 12th a transfer certificate of the candidate issued by the last institute attended candidate NEET scorecard admit card of the NEET examination candidates original and valid ID proof that is Aadhaar card PAN card voter ID card driving license or passport candidates belonging to the reserve category like SC ST, OBC or person with disability must provide the uh, certificate for the same that means for any category you are entering into the process counseling process you need to uh, submit the certificate or the supporting documents for that category candidates resident pro residence proof that is also needed to prove that you are a domicile of that particular state now the list of reservation system in Andhra Pradesh here it goes for SC candidates 15 percent seats are reserved for scheduled tribes in local area 8 uh, 6 percent seats are reserved <coughs> for EWS 10 percent backward classes it is 29 percent and that is segregated into different subcategories like BCA 7 percent BCB 10 percent BCC 1 percent BCD 7 percent BCE 
four percent, and women candidates in all it is thirty three point three percent. It's a parallel reservation. Army candidates one percent, NCC candidates one percent, sports category zero point five percent, person with disability, physically challenged people it is five percent, and police martyr children it is twenty five percent. Uh, so this is the reservation criteria. Sorry, 0.25 percent. So this is the reservation criteria for Andhra Pradesh. Remaining are the seats for open or general category. Apart from that, one seat in Siddhartha Medical College, Vijayawada, is reserved for Anglo-Indian candidates, and uh, the candidate should produce minority certificate to claim this seat. If any reserved ST seats are not filled up, they will be allotted to the candidates belonging to the scheduled caste, and vice versa. so if you have a seat vacant in st and there is no candidate it will be allotted to sc and if a seat is vacant in sc and no candidate is available it will be allotted to st like vice versa if sc and st both are not claiming up that seat it will be allotted to the open competition or general candidate so this is the reservation criteria now as you are anxiously waiting for the cut off so this is the expected cut off for telangana so for andhra pradesh state uh, make sure that you have a score nearby somewhere here then you can enter into the counseling process uh, only thing is that these are mere predictions they may not be actual because whatever i have uh, research i have done it is on the basis of last year uh, last year's scores of the candidates what was the last year's mop up round on which marks the seat was closed apart from that over the period of time how many seats have increased what was the difficulty level of the neat exam how many claimants can be there for one particular seat so these are all the factors which decide cut off so it may vary year after year for sc candidates the marks can be up to 495 for scheduled tribes in local area it can be up to 460 for ews it is 565 backward classes it can be up to 550 women candidates it will be 520 and unreserved seats can be up to 578 so this is the uh, roughly cut off for tamil for uh, andhra pradesh now we'll be saying uh, seeing the cut off for telangana state this is the list of documents that you need to procure before you start your counseling system and counseling process it is a neat 2023 admit card neat 2023 score card then you should have an a, a, an updated aadhar card certificate of class 10th or birth certificate mark sheet of class 10th or 12th transfer certificate from the last institute from the last institute what you have attended caste or community certificate if applicable then you must have ssc or sslc certificate for parent or relative if applicable minority certificate if applicable income certificate for those claiming seat under ews or fee exemption category ews certificate for those claiming reservation under ews category residence certificate for a minimum period of 10 years especially for the candidates who have completed their education outside telangana so they must have this certificate with them so what is the seat matrix and what is the reservation system let us see for seat matrix uh, you have total we have total number of 290 2990 mbbs government medical college seats and 4100 private medical colleges seats for mbbs so that gives us a total of 7090 7090 for mbbs government as well as private whereas bachelor of dental surgery uh, seats are only 100 and that too in government medical uh, dental college for private it is 1190 it gives us a total of 1290 for all bds seats for telangana state total number of colleges in uh, telangana states are nine in telangana state are 19 total number of private um, mbbs colleges in telangana are 24 total number of dental college in telangana is one whereas private dental colleges are 13 so this is the seat matrix now we'll be seeing the reservation system of telangana state for sc category 15% seats are reserved for st category it is 6% backward classes it's 29% women candidates it's 3% army quota is 1% ncc is 1% sports and game is 5% person with disability is uh, 3% and police martyr children it is 
0.25 percent. So this is the reservation quota for Telangana state. Remaining are the general or open seats. So this is the reservation system of Telangana. Now we'll be seeing the expected cutoff of Telangana state. So this is the expected cutoff. If you have got marks somewhere near, you are. Uh, congr I congratulate you. You have a better chance of getting an MBBS seat in a good government medical college. So for SC, the marks can be up to 490. For scheduled tribes, it can be 448. For backward classes, it is 540. For women, it is 512. For army, it can be up to 514. And for unreserved, it will be. It might be up to 561. So this was Telangana state's uh, cutoff figures, expected cutoff figures for 2023. so just in case if your neat score is not good do not worry about that because i have already shared one video where i have given you the detail about if you how what will happen if you can take up your mbbs course absolutely free so link is there in the description box you can watch that full video apart from that you can watch that video for the national quota and you can watch that video for aims also so with that i end this video I hope your marks will be definitely be getting you a good government MBBS college. If you have any query, any complaint, uh, any uh, suggestion, also you can write to me. Look, my number is there on the screen. If you want to take up MBBS course ab absolutely free, if you have watched that video, you can fill up this QR code which is there on the screen. You can fill up this QR code, so you will be directly registered, and we will be making you a Zoom call where the department. admission department of that college will be giving you free counseling and whether are you eligible to take up that mbbs course virtually free so with that i end this video happy counseling all the best take care bye bye